guys, this is Sushi Hippo. And if you mean the title, this is gonna be my first top. No, it's not a top ten video. It's a top five video. So, so this, so it seems like getting blamed for something you don't actually do is like the worst. One thing in this list, if I actually didn't realize, sheesh. No one will watch me. So, but I never actually did any of these things. Keep in mind. So if you didn't read the title, it's... Top 5 things I got blamed for but didn't actually do. So, number 5. Eating a band-aid. So, this was like a year ago. And we, and in school, we did a report. Like where you had to dip it in coffee and where you had to dip like a paper in coffee and tea to make it look like old and stuff. But so after we did the report, I saw a piece of the report on my desk. So So I was like, hmm, I wonder what it would taste like. Would it taste like coffee or tea? So I put it in my mouth. It tasted like coffee, but every but then everyone was whispering like, "What's going on?" And then my friends were like, "Ew, that's disgusting!" And I was like, "What?" And then I asked him, "What the heck?" And then he said, "I ate a band aid." That would be disgusting. Who would eat a band aid? So. I eventually made it clear that it, it was a piece of that report, and it was supposed to, uh, and it was, like, I was not eating my whole report, just so you know, but it was just that thing, that a piece of it. So, going on to number four. Liking someone's girlfriend. Okay, so... I got blamed. Okay, so this started like five or four or five months ago. So my so my friends were at like this fall festival at my school. It's so weird. Okay, this is a cup. Anyway, so there was like this fall festival at my school, and my friends were there. There was this kid. Who claimed he had a girlfriend, and and then my friends dared me to try to hit on her. So I was like, so I was like, okay, it's fine. I can tell her it was a dare. So I did it. I I told them it was a dare, but no one seemed to believe. Okay, what the heck, doing? <laughs> Hey, I'm sorry, Dylan walked in the room, and I, if this is gonna be an only me video, so, or was I, oh, yeah, six months later, like, he's still mad at me, like, it wasn't there, let's get that clear, but now he bought, the, but now he put that back out of my mind, and we still make fun of him for it, so, joke's on him. Ha. Huh. Okay, so number three. Punching a kid in the face. This is really violent, but one time I got blamed for punching a kid in the face. Did not actually do this. Do not, do not arrest me. Do not call the police. I did not actually punch a kid in the face. Okay, so I was like five or six at the time. I'm eleven now, so. So, so I I used to play these games by myself. Like I used to have this game where I pretend to be like different stuff. Like there was this one game where I had this weird machine called a dream ship. Like I like I it was kind of like the magic school bus, but I used to play hula hoop, and I also had this monkey named Monk Monk, which is like one of those like monkeys in a barrel. 
So I was doing that and pretending to be like a bad guy of some sort. So first I was becoming a prisoner, which is probably like any sort of bad guy, or, uh, uh, which is which any bad guy could probably be. And then I was done. And I was like, I'll be a murderer. So I was going up to these kids, pretending to kill them. Like, Rah! I did that. But then a kid's mom came up to me and said, and I was like, what are you talking to me? And then she was like, oh, me, my son said you punched him. And I was like, what? I did not. But then she came and got my dad. Got in huge trouble. Like, I didn't punch him. Maybe I was pretending to go, Wah! But that was not, but I did not touch him. So, number three. Three. Like, this was actually a couple days ago. So, we wanted this overnight trip to, like, a place called Astro Camp. And, and on the bus ride back, everyone was sleeping. So, I was looking at the girls for one millisecond, but one of the girls woke up. And then thought I was watching them in their sleep, which is very creepy. And then they got mad at me because my friend was trying to make up like a conversation. And then, and then I was like, uh, I was not trying to stare at you, but then, but no one believed me. This one was pretty short, but they still think I watched them in their sleep. Then, okay, before I go to number one, here are some honorable mentions. So, the number one stupidest thing I got blamed for but didn't actually do was try to kiss girls. Really, this is, that was stupid. So, when, when I first came to my school, like, like, everyone was like, oh no, he tried to kiss us, and then I just went along with it. Like, I was like, I was just like, okay, mm, but I was never actually going to kiss anyone, but one day... I got in trouble, so I was like, okay, they actually believe it, so I'm going to stop. But, two years later, I was trying to play with one of my friends, the girl, who's a girl, and then a bunch of her friends were like, ah! and then I was like, why are you running away from me? And they're like, you're trying to kiss us. And then, and then I was like trying to make it clear, but they were already like halfway across the yard. So I was trying to tell them, and it took me like all of recess and all of like, and all of like, and then all of like, until the next day, like my like I don't know, I, like, and then my friend who was like, that's a look him in like serious. And then there was this thing, and then there was a thing going around where I was a terrorist, and I was like, I hate myself. So, that wraps up our video. Hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe, and punch that like button! Okay, where's... Okay. So, goodbye!